Mr. Speaker, in Singapore, water is priced to reflect its scarcity value. We have raised water prices to reflect the rising costs of water supply so that our water system remains financially sustainable. This will allow us to continue investing ahead of time to ensure a secure and reliable water supply while encouraging everyone to conserve this precious resource and use it wisely. I mentioned during my ministry's Committee of Supply debate this year that Singapore's daily household water consumption has decreased from 148 litres per person in 2016 to 143 litres per person in 2017. This is encouraging. The increase in water prices is not the sole reason for the reduction in household water consumption. Our water, our water conservation measures, such as minimum water efficiency standards and the mandatory water efficiency labelling of water fittings and appliances, are also important factors. Over the years, we have progressively expanded the mandatory water efficiency labelling scheme to cover more fittings and appliances and phased out the less efficient ones. These efforts are bearing fruit. PUB's household water consumption study last year showed that more than half of the water fittings and appliances used by households are water efficient models. We will continue to encourage the use of more water efficient products. Starting this month, PUB will require all these washers sold in Singapore for household use to have a water efficiency level so that consumers can make informed purchasing decisions. From April next year, all other water fittings with a one tick rating will be phased out, out of the market. To further boost this effort, the Water Closet Replacement Project was launched, where PUB has successfully replaced non-water efficient water closets, basin, and kitchen taps for some 3,700 eligible households to date. Recognizing that showering contributes most to household water usage, smart water devices will be installed in 10,000 new homes over these two years to motivate residents to watch and cut down on water usage during showers. PUB is also keeping up its efforts in the non-domestic sector PUB has been working closely with more than 600 large water users in the submission of their water efficiency management plans. PUB is working with companies to progressively develop and make available water efficiency benchmarks and best practices guides. This will be resources developed with the industry for the industry. Companies have already responded positively with a number looking to implement water efficiency projects. Water is a scarce project. It's a, water is a scarce resource that should not be taken for granted, ever. I urge everyone to do our part to use water wisely so that we can continue to enjoy it for years to come.